We got Lamar Jackson and Todd Munkin. Todd Munkin was a defensive coordinator for both the the national championship teams that Georgia's had back to back. This year, he goes and expands his talents to the Baltimore Ravens. He's definitely opened up the passing game this year. And I got a couple interesting things about it. But if you look, it's not the Mark Andrews show. And it's also not the running game show this year. Todd Munkin is starting to open it up for these guys. And I, you know, they, in some areas, they look really, really bad. But Lamar Jackson has a 74.5 completion percentage right now this year in two games. I know it's two games, but hear me out. When, how many games in his 72 starts do you think that he's thrown for 74% or better? It's only been 10. 10 out of the 72 games that he has played in have been over 74%. Todd Munkin's got something going. He's passed for over 70% in his last two games back-to-back. I don't know how many back-to-back games he's had with 70%, but I'm just wondering if this week is going to be continuous the same. Is it going to stay above the 70% every single week like we think it is? So he's pretty much lost Odell Beckham Jr., which he wasn't really a factor anyways. Zay Jones has filled in really, really nicely for him, and he also lost J.K. Dobbins for the whole season in the first game with a torn Achilles. So relying on Gus Edwards, I would love to see Isaiah likely get more involved in in the tight end game. Also Mark Andrews. Mark Andrews has been a really good spot for him as well. Rashad Bateman still battling through his his issues there. Um, there, there's a there's a lot to like about what Lamar and Todd Munkin are doing together as as a unit. Um, and I did say that he was a defense coordinator. No, he was the offensive coordinator. Sorry, I have to go back and edit offensive coordinator. But what, what Todd Munkin's doing with Lamar should not be overlooked. Um, it's bringing a different dynamic. Him and John Harbaugh have a, they have a lot to deal with because they're they lost a lot of weapons. I mean. I don't think Tyler Linderbaum is healthy. Um, and, and a couple more of those pieces on that team are just not healthy, even on the defense. So the Baltimore Ravens are known for the defense, and I hope they get all that stuff together. But Todd Munkin is going to continue to get this guy right. And if you see some of the passes that Lamar has made over the past couple of weeks, it's not a fluke. He's throwing downfield for all the haters out there. I mean, he was doing it last time, too, when he had Mark Marquise Hollywood Brown on his team throwing floaters downfield that Marquise would drop. So the fact that people say that he's a glorified running back is kind of crazy, but even more so, they got they got this thing rocking, man. 